The Supreme Court struggled Thursday with whether former presidents can face criminal prosecutions. The case was brought by President Trump challenging his criminal prosecution by special counsel Jack Smith over his contest of the 2020 election results. His lawyers say to be criminally prosecuted, a president has to first be impeached and convicted. They say to allow criminal prosecutions of former presidents would limit the presidency, causing the president to second guess every decision. There needs to be impeachment and conviction beforehand. On the other hand, the Justice Department, through special counsel Jack Smith's team, says the founders believed the president was not a king. The Justice Department lawyer argued there is no immunity clause in the Constitution for the presidency. There is no immunity that is in the Constitution unless this court creates it today. The justices on both sides of the aisle, though, appeared willing to draw some sort of line on immunity for presidents for certain official acts, but not others. A ruling could involve a test about what constitutes an official act for lower courts to apply when reviewing charges. That, in turn, could delay the start of any trial brought by special counsel Jack Smith against President Trump. To read more about the case and for more on today's arguments, go to WashingtonTimes.com.